Hey, science explorers, we are starting a new topic called the respiratory system. Please open your learner's book six, page 12. In this lesson, we will learn how our body breathes, what parts are involved. Let's get started. What is the respiratory system? The respiratory system helps us breathe. It brings oxygen into our body and gets rid of a gas called carbon dioxide. Oxygen is very important because our body needs it to make energy. Let's look at the parts of the respiratory system, the nose and mouth, where the air enters, the windpipe, also called the trachea, the lungs, where oxygen is taken into the body, and the diaphragm and ribs, which help us breathe in and out. How do we breathe? We need oxygen to live. Oxygen helps our body cells work properly. It gives us the energy we need to move, grow, play, and learn. Let's look at what happens when we breathe in and out using the diagram. Step 1. Breathing and inhalation When we breathe in, air enters through the nose or mouth. It travels down the windpipe trachea. The ribs move up and out. The chest gets bigger and the lungs fill with air. The diaphragm contracts and moves downwards. This makes space for the lungs to expand. That's why your chest goes up when you take a deep breath. Step 2. Breathing out exhalation When we breathe out, air leaves through the nose or mouth. The ribs move down and in. The chest gets smaller. The diaphragm relaxes and moves upwards. This pushes the air out of the lungs. Carbon dioxide is a waste gas. Our body doesn't need it, so we breathe it out. Summary of breathing. When we breathe in, oxygen goes into our lungs. When we breathe out, carbon dioxide leaves the body the ribs and diaphragm help make this movement happen. That's how we breathe, connection to the circulatory system. Let's see how the circulatory system works with the respiratory system. The lungs contain tiny air sacs called alveoli. Around the alveoli are tiny blood vessels called capillaries. Oxygen from the alveoli moves into the blood. Red blood cells pick up the oxygen. The heart pumps this oxygen-rich blood to the whole body, so the lungs give oxygen to the blood, and the blood carries it to all the cells in your body at the same time. Body cells use oxygen and make carbon dioxide CO. The blood carries CO back to the lungs. Then we breathe it out. Final summary, the respiratory system brings in oxygen and removes carbon dioxide. The circulatory system carries oxygen to the cells and brings carbon dioxide back. What is breathing rate? Let's talk about breathing rate. Your breathing rate is the number of breaths you take in one minute. When you are calm, you usually breathe 12 to 20 times per minute. But when you run or exercise, your breathing gets faster. Why? Because your body needs more oxygen. Let's try a quick activity. Place your hand on your chest. Count how many times you breathe in one minute. Use a timer or ask a friend to help this shows how your body reacts when you move. Thank you for watching. Follow Explore Science for more exciting science lessons.